Now let's see some uses of air and how air is important for us. Moving air, that is the wind, has great force. It enables the movement of sailboats and gliders. It runs windmills, which are used to generate electricity. Wind also helps in the dispersal of seeds. Air supports combustion. That is, combustion or burning is possible because of air and more precisely oxygen in the air. If there is no oxygen, there can be no combustion. Let's see an activity to prove it. Take a burning candle and now invert a glass over it and observe what happens. After some time, the candle will go off on its own. How did it happen? Or why did it happen so? It is because the combustion uses oxygen in the air and when all oxygen is used from the air in the glass, the combustion stops by its own as there is no oxygen left in the glass. So kids, there can be no combustion without oxygen, which is present in the air. And we need combustion for just so many purposes. We need combustion to cook many types of food. We need combustion to generate heat. We need combustion to produce electricity in thermal power plants. We need combustion to run many industries and even run vehicles as engines of vehicles too run with the help of combustion of fuel in them. Even for hairstyling, we use hair dryers to dry and style our hair. Air is used to keep us warm too. Wool and clothes are worn because there is air trapped in small places in the woolen fabric. So kids, today we learned a lot about air and we should do our best to keep it clean and fresh. Now go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. And if you want to see more fun videos, you can hit that subscribe button. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram for more content. Bye-bye.